Okay, what I have here is a 28 volt power supply, regulated, 25 amp, 18 amp continuous. This is normally an Astron 50 amp, 12 volt, 13.8 volt power supply. This was made by unit or made by Astron for unit repeated system. What I plan to do is take the regulation system out, disabling the regulation and get purely 40 volt DC. I'm going to do this pretty quick. A screwdriver, solder iron, a little bit of solder. This is the first thing you do is short out the capacitor to make sure that you don't ground out later. Next thing is you pop these two screws off to get into the regulator board. You not talk as much as you think here. You do a lot of action. I'm going to cut off the scent line here. Also a scent line here. Two of the power leads that go back to the power transformer that supply this board. Don't need them. There's also a MOSFET down under here and a transistor here. Those got to be removed. A little, that's a TL3 case with a little twist. Pop straight off. You use that to hold the screws. You won't be needing this regulator. Next thing, we have to remove the capacitor, the smaller capacitor here. It's not rated for the voltages we need. We need 40 volts. It's only rated for 35. I don't know how my audio is coming here, but you'll get the idea in a minute. That one's pretty quick. I'm only going to be using one lead off of this. Not that one. This one here. Cut one lead off of here. A black lead off the staff of this. We're going to be using the ground and the hot lead and these positive systems and doing away with the regulator. Stuff this back in there real quick. 
have that set there. Okay, we'll get to that. I'm going to have to, uh, let me see, to get this thing out of here. I don't remember now. Where was I? I'm going to cut this cap right out. Well, you can leave it. It really don't matter. I think it's done all the cut here. Okay, Line gone. And positive and negative lead like fed off the board here. Okay, put those off. Yeah. One regulator. Socket. Extra. Mount that inside here later in some plastic. You'll always have it. So now. Okay. Yeah. Now we have the positive side of that rack on. You've got to take this lead off and remove this one from this rack and jump it over here. This doesn't take much. down to the strap here. Give it a little bit of heat. Spin right off of that bar. Okay. I'm going to stick that over in there. I'm going to remove this wire from this strap. That positive strap, and it goes to here, the positive here. So we just removed this one, so we just put it right back on this one. Basically, that's it. Take the regulator out. Make sure there's nothing here. Make sure there's nothing over here. Oh, we got one here we got to take off. We got positive strap there. I'm just using the fastest or the strap here. Let's go to the diet. So, the next one. Let's take this strap comes right over to the positive here. To the diode pack. The output of this pack comes to the other side of the diode pack. That's it. Pretty simple. A little solder on the pack in here.
is here, and one diode, positive or not positive, but one side of the transformer goes to each side of the diode pack. One comes up to the capacitor, charge them, keep it tilted off. The other piece lead comes here, the other one leads here. This is a small LED wire that you won't need. Goes to the front panel, pop that. So we're not using <coughs> anything on this side, just the power. There's nothing on this side, just the diode. So you got a transformer, diode set, a couple of capacitors, 40 volts DC output. Non-regulated, we don't need to regulate it. Thanks for watching.